Hello guys, so today we'll be fixing some problem that has occurred many times for people when making a character controller controller. Uh, the problem is when I'm gonna show you it here when you jump there's gonna be a delay when it gets gets back. As you can see there's some delay. It, it just doesn't bounce off the wall in the ceiling. So we're gonna go ahead and fix that, as you can see. There's a, there's some delay. Um, the theory in here is that we have to get the velocity y, the the gravity we're going. Um, you you will have this thing when you are making a character controller with the gravity. You need the velocity y. You you have to when it's not grounded. You need to check if the velocity 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 y is greater than zero point one. Is if it, it means if if it is going up, if it is jumping. And you need to check if the character control the velocity. This velocity is going to be zero when it's um, the, the velocity of y. Yeah, the velocity of y is going to be zero when it's stuck at the ceiling. So if it is less than 0.1, it's not going to be precise that it's going to be zero, but it's going to be less than uh, 0.1. So velocity dot y. Okay, I forgot that. I'm using a vector sheet to do the gravity. So if the velocity dot y is greater than 0 0.1 and the character control dot velocity dot y is less than 0 0.1, then after that you just have to see here velocity y equals zero. Here we go. Or we can, if you want, if you want it to to be a hard bounce, you can just make this and get a random. And that should do pretty much solve our problem so if you go ahead and click the play button now just jump as you can see it's good it's, it's, it's just going to bounce off the ceiling yeah that's very good thanks for watching and bye